What's going on guys, Summerfine Gamer here, welcome back to Wolfenstein 2. Let's see what this puppy can do. a shame. I quite like riding that thing. It's very OP. Anya, come in Anya, do you read? William, I read you. What's happening? You okay there, darling? I'm doing... Uh, fine. <laughs> I'm trying to regroup with Fergus. I've contacted Grace. The U-boat is on its way in. And we are on our way to Lakeview District. Well, listen, don't do anything reckless. Now you stay safe. I'll be fine. Anya out. Horton. What's your status? Rounding up the last of the people and fixing to leave. Now make your way to the Lakeview District. Bring everyone. We're getting a ride out of here. Well, Billy, that might be a fine idea in theory, but I reckon all them Nazis between here and yonder might slow us down dearly. Wager I can get their attention. Next stop, Lakeview District. Objective, kill them all. Well, that's a great objective. Blood's cool. Bob Town by Nazis here. Foster's top side of the. Get on ya! What's the name of this fucking place? We're on the roof of the Lakeview apartment building. I think we can hold out for a wee bit, but these Nazis keep coming like torrential diarrhea. Hey, Billy, we've met up with your people on the roof of the Lakeview apartment building. That ride of yours better get here soon, because we won't hold out much longer. Hey, Conrad, you up and went on a tropical cruise with our boat? The Nazis are fucking killing us here. Fergus, I read. Sorry, we're being held up. Working to resolve the problem. Keep doing what you're doing, Anya! If we're going down, we're going down fighting! Grace! We need evacuation now! Jesus Christ, Grace, that was close! Conrag, mind you, but you're the most lovable Conrag I've ever laid eyes on. Fergus, Anya, help everyone get on board the U-boat. The Nazis will regroup and attack. Hurry up. Laskowitz, get your ass up on the Lakeview apartment building roof and climb on board the U-boat. We've spotted the outsmerts on the radar. It'll be here any minute. Haul ass. Blazkowicz, all of the evacuees are on board, but we can't leave. Props are stuck in the mud. We're stranded, and the outsmercer is incoming. If it gets here before we bail, we are fucked. I say it's time to ready the nuclear cannon. What are you talking about, Fergus? I figure the shockwave from the atom bomb could push the boat out to sea. Now that's the stupidest fucking plan I have ever heard. Set. Well, for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. Blazkowicz, hop on the nuclear cannon and fire it to maximum distance. I just hope it's far enough away from us not to rupture the hull. You have to fire now, Blaskowitz! Now! Run! 
Got it. Looks like the Alice Mercer lost track of us. Clear skies on the scope? For our angle, commands are now. Using the taunt terrorists. But in the way back, the Alice Mercer would roam from city to city, crushing any resistance. Now, if we ignite a revolt, you can be sure the Alice Mercer would swoop in, put an end to it, break and say hell's bells. But we're gonna start this revolution. We need to put an end to the Alice Mercer firstly. So then we mount a surprise attack conquer the Ausmercer and use it against the Nazis. Well, the Ausmercer is protected by an automated security system called Odin. Seen it when I was up there. We'll hijack the system, find the Odin codes, and disable the fucking thing. Yeah, but that kind of information is a top military secret. Only the Oberkommando is privy to it. Sounds like your basic Nazi military facility infill. I'll break into the Oberkommando and steal the information off their, uh, computing machines. Not a problem. Except for the fact that the Oberkommando is now on fucking planet Venus. Venus? Ever since you obliterated the Oberkommando at Roswell with that nuclear bloody warhead, the Nazis have been trying to shove the shite back into the horse. So, they moved the Oberkommando to another fucking planet to keep it away from us. All of their top brass, all their top military secrets have been moved to a fully secured base on Venus. Venus. There is no way you are making it to Venus, sunshine. I don't care how mighty your arsenal or how much fucking manpower. There is not a hope in hell you can bypass all that security. Yeah? Not with that attitude. Except maybe there is. In two days, final auditions for the role of the infamous terrorist William Terror Billy Glaskowitz take place on the enigmatic Aristat habitat on Venus. One of the hopeful actors is Jules Redfield, here getting a snack from his favorite milkshake bar in his hometown of Needles, California. What you thinking, Anya? William and I are going for milkshakes. His papers are all in his glove box. Yeah. What about him? Mm -hmm. Well, is he a Nazi? You a Nazi fella? Mm -hmm. yeah. Can't even tell no more. <sighs> How I look? Like a walrus. Don't forget your luggage. Remember, you are Jules Redfield, professional actor traveling to Venus to audition for the part of William Joseph Blaskovich. Now, you are summoned by personal invitation, so security should be minimal. Break a leg. Mr. Redfield? Mr. You, Sir Redfield? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, that, that's me. I'm Helena, the director of this film. Apologies for the long journey, but my producer favors a safe location and has an affinity for dramatic settings. Uh, come. Oh, uh... My, my luggage. Someone will bring it for you. Come, come. Welcome. Welcome to the audition, Mr. Redfield. Now that you're all here, I ask you to prepare yourselves. You must be off book for this audition, so be sure to memorize your lines before the producer gets here. He has a volatile disposition, so be careful what you say and do in his presence. Mr. Redfield, I can't stress enough how important it is you learn these lines by heart. Your script is on the chair. I will be with you shortly. Can't blow my cover. Better keep a low profile. Leave the pretend acting for those so inclined. Your agent got you on the short list for this? No, nah, man. Casting director saw me on a mystery show. Thought I had the right face. This is exciting, man. Venus and all. Yeah, I don't know. That's a little weird, though. No. Why Venus? What's wrong with L.A.? Producer got to be a real big cheese. Yeah. Muhammad must go to the mountain type deal. Yeah. Any stage experience? What was your name? Roland, was it? 
Ronald. Ronald. Now, I used to do uh, broadcasts uh, when I was younger. Nowadays, it's all pictures and TV. Yeah, I thought about doing film acting, but I just love the theater. You know, I'm not sure I even want this role. It's not like real acting unless you're on a stage in front of a live audience. You know what I mean. Sure thing, Chief. Unbelievable. I will murder your dirty How am I supposed to remember this shit? I gotta write this down. I'll murder... Oh! Places, places, quickly! <coughs> Hide Hitler! Hide Hitler! <coughs> Helene! Ja, kommen Sie! Haben Sie das gesehen? Fremde in meinem Büro. Würden Sie mir bitte verraten, wer in Gottes Namen das ist? Ja, ja, es sind Schauspieler, mein Führer. Schauspieler? Ja. Diese Männer wollen für die Rolle von William Josef Blaskowitz vorsprechen. Es sind Schauspieler. Es tut mir leid, meine Nachricht hat sie wohl nicht erreicht. Was? Und besser konnten wir nicht finden. Keiner von denen sieht dem Kerl auch nur ähnlich. Ja, 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 das kriegen Gott wir. Gott nochmal! Das kriegen wir mit Schminke hin, mein, mein Führer. Oh ja, Schminke. Mhm. Gut. Das ist magisch. 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 <lacht> Schauspieler. Geschult in der Kunst der Verkleidung und der Täuschung. Ja, ähnlich wie Spione. Vielleicht ist er ein Spion unter Ihnen. Sie haben sicher alle mein Buch gelesen. Oh, yes, mein Führer. And my children have read it too. I loved it, Mr. Hitler. Super good. Mr. Hitler. Wenn Sie mich ansprechen, sagen Sie, mein Führer. Verstanden? Haben Sie keinen Respekt vor Autorität? Ihre Worte gewähren Einblick in einen höchst verraterischen Geist. I am so sorry, mein Führer. Sind Sie denn ein Idiot? No, mein Führer. Sind Sie ein verkleideter Schurke, ein Jude? Ein verräterischer Jude? No, no, mein Führer. I'm... I'm from Arizona. <lacht> Wieder Wölfe im Schafspelz, konspirierende, lügende, niederträchtige Juden. Ich erkenne sie schon von Weitem. Wenn Sie mein Buch gelesen haben, wissen Sie, dass ich die Wahrheit kenne. Und wer die Wahrheit auf seiner Seite hat, der gewinnt immer. So konnte ich die Welt von den Juden reinigen und so konnte ich die minderwertigen Kommunisten in die Knie zwingen. Oh, so ging das. Ich habe ihn vernichtet. William oh, Josef Platzkowitsch. Oh. Oh. Ah. Helene. Mein absolutes Meisterstück, das Jahrhundert Epos und mein künstlerisches Erbe. Wer mein Drehbuch liest, der wird die zahllosen Stunden zu schätzen wissen, die ich aufgewendet habe, damit jede Szene, jeder Zeile, jeder Silber fehlerfrei ist. Bravo, mein Führer, bravo! <lacht> Mutti, mir ist so kalt. 
Gott. Weg! Fuck. Sie! Sie spielen die Szene. Helene! Zusammen mit Ihnen! A cold-blooded terrorist! That is what you are! What the hell did I write? And you are a Nazi whore. You monster! What are you going to do to me? Uh... I will rape and murder you. So many German innocent lives you have killed, but the German race will rise again! Shit. I will murder your dirty race, too. Die Worte waren richtig, ja. Aber sie haben anscheinend nicht die mindeste Ahnung von der Psyche eines Mannes wie William Josef Blatzkowitsch. Wie können Sie sein, was Sie nicht verstehen? Sie. Spielen Sie die Rolle. Füllen Sie, füllen Sie, füllen Sie die Rolle. A cold-blooded terrorist. That is what you are. And you're a Nazi whore. You monster. What are you going to do to me? I will rape you. And I will murder you. So many German innocent lives you have killed. But the German race will rise again. And I will murder your dirty race, too. <laughs> Wie besser Sie könnten von ihm lernen. Ich gebe Ihnen, was Sie brauchen, um den Geist dieses Irren zu verstehen, dieses dreckigen Untermensch. Oh, ich kannte ihn. In- und auswendig. Und darum konnte ich ihn gefangen nehmen und ihn der Gerechtigkeit übergeben. <lacht> mein Gott. Mein Gott, habe ich Hunger. William Josef Blatzkowitsch. <lacht> Aufgewachsen in Mesquite, Texas. Mischlingskind eines Verkäufers und einer polnischen Jüdin. Die Mutter wurde vom Vater ausgeliefert, starb in einem Vernichtungslager in Neumexiko. Selbst als Erwachsener waren seine geistigen Fähigkeiten noch die eines Kindes. Und tatsächlich, als wir nach seiner Exekution aufschnitten, konnte man sehen, dass er Jude ist. Helene, machen Sie weiter. Ich bin müde. Aspirants, as you know, this role is very physical. William Josef Bloskowitz was not a man of intellect, He was a man of action. The scene takes place right before the scene you did earlier. Blaskowitz is about to plant the bombs that will massacre the German children in the orphanage. But first, he must eliminate the brave soldier standing guard outside the school in a brutal fight scene. Mr. Le Llewellyn Irving? Llewellyn Ewing. Yeah. Why don't you start? You will each improvise a fight sequence. And uh, once the guard is eliminated, uh, you finish the scene by reading the lines from the cue card, exactly as written. Places and action. <coughs> oh, 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 stop, stop. Oh, God, I, I'm bleeding, I'm bleeding. I, I, I need to take a break. Line, please. Yeah, I need a doctor. Line. Okay. Your bravery is no match for a Neanderthal like myself. Besides, I only know how to fight in a dirty manner. And now, to kill all the innocent children, Germany's future. Ha 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 ha. Oh, God. Ah! Oh, God, you. Ah! 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 Why? 
Mr. Redfield, please. The floor is yours. There we go then. Und action. Dann mach es mal richtig, du wichtig Tor. you wanted? Is that what you had in mind? You Nazi assholes. Because that's all you're getting. Wunderbar. Wunderbar. Haben Sie das gesehen, Helene? Wie geboren für die Rolle. Er, oh, er wird mein Platz gewinnen. Oh Gott. Er ist mehr als perfekt. Let me help you unpack, Mr. Redfield. Was zur Hölle ist das? Brace yourself, Adolf. I'm leaving here with your secret Odin codes. Then we steal the Ausmerzer, take out General Angle, and show the American people what revolution looks like. Well, we'll do all that in the next episode, because I'm going to leave it here. Leave a like, enjoy watching, don't forget to subscribe, and goodbye. Grab your wife, better get out of sight. Who do you, who do, bitch? Let's go.